Boston. So Boston is a key strategic location for foreign representation as the science and technology field is growing in importance for international relations. We all know this, that Boston has a lot to offer. Uh, within the Throwstone you have thousands of students, you have very interesting people and you have really, I would say, an exploding collaborative spirit when it comes to startup and innovation. All the uh, pieces of the puzzles are here and all these pieces need to be put together by all of us that want to make science and technology the way forward in the innovation economies of tomorrow. Boston has really put also a lot of efforts into thinking about the uh, future uh, activities like mass challenges that now also has a lot of international components, uh, the innovation districts that's being home to uh, many many more innovative companies and also places like the entrepreneurial walk of fame. All this mixed with some very smart networking from Boston World Partnership and some other group means that the Boston area will continue to be a key component when it comes to interacting with other leading regions in science and technology for the future. I think for the future, uh, diplomacy is going to be more and more made in an open source fashion. Whereas before state-to-state -state diplomacy was the norm, it looks like now non-state actors, be it universities and fast-growing companies, are going to become essential. Combine this with the uh, desire of many countries to become leading uh, world in innovation economy, and you have the fact that science and technology is really a driver for all of us.